To the left, to the left, to the left, to the left, to the right, to the right, to the right. Why does that guy have to scream so loud in that song? Oh, that song is killing me. Hi, guys. Here's another short one, but this cop is a stupid blue line pig terrorist. As you can see, he's wearing the blue line pig terrorist ISIS patch right on his uh, right above his stupid name. Okay. And this video is by IDC Chris. See him right here. IDC Chris. I'm going to subscribe. I'm going to click the bell. I'm going to click all. I'm going to click the thumbs up and please do the same for my video. And if you don't want to hear me talking, leave right now. Don't watch the whole thing and tell me how to run my videos. Okay. Leave right now. If you leave a comment in the comments saying something dumb, that's exactly what you will be dumb and stupid and ignorant. So bye Felicia. Otherwise, here we go. This kid, Chris, I guess his name is, is doing a First Amendment audit. And the first thing you see here is super creepy for some reason. And then this stupid pig you see here comes up to him and starts cop-splaining and lying and being de decept, decept, deceiving, being deceiving and just being an all right tyrant pig. All right, here we go. There's the creepy part right there. Look at this. This is in front of the police station. So you got a cop. He's looking kind of alienish and creepy and Kristen Wa Christopher walking, Christopher walking ish. And he's holding a little boy. He's got his arm on the shoulder of a little boy. He's got his other hand by his junk. His junk is really defined in the picture for some reason. The artist thought it would be good to accentuate the crotch area. I don't know, man. That part's creepy. So now I'm going to fast forward to three minutes because he just walks around, just takes pictures. Three minutes and about 20 seconds. And we're going to go from here. Oh, crap. You guys are probably seeing this in miniature right now. All right, I'm not starting the whole thing over. So you're going to get the gist of it. Here comes Piggly Wiggly Super Tyrant. Gas is expensive all the way in Peru. By the way, this video is imported from Peru. Peru, Illinois. Yes, sir. Nothing. I mean, I'd prefer not to answer any questions. I prefer not to answer any questions. What do you mean? What didn't you understand? I see already I'm insulted by this stupid pig. Already. I prefer not to answer. What do you mean? Uh, did I not say it in English? Are you all right? I mean... Yeah, no, no, everything's good. Just enjoying my fourth. Your what? My fourth. Your fourth what? Fourth day of July. Fourth day of July. You, you, the fourth relative of yours are banging. Fourth of July? Yeah. You just enjoy it then? Yeah, of course. Well, somebody was concerned that you're out there videotaping something. That's why we want to make sure. That Nobody's concerned that you're out there uh, engaged in constitutionally protected activity, which I swore to uphold. All right. Okay. Do you need police assistance? No. No? No, sir. Where are you from? So twice he said, I prefer not to answer, and I don't need assistance. Um, I honestly prefer not to answer. Well, there's a couple things you do have to answer, okay? Oh, there's a couple things you do have to answer. Lying, stupid, lying pig, Brown, from Peru, Illinois. You're a lying pig, and watch how he starts lying even worse. Since you, you obviously know your rights, right? I do. Okay. Uh, do you have to identify yourself to police? If I did something illegal. But you do have to identify If I did something illegal. Okay. Yeah. Am, I, am I being detained? Not, are you illegal? If I did something illegal, yeah. If the cop believes that he did, is, or about to commit a crime, he can detain him. So now the guy asks, am I being detained? I'm going back 10 seconds. Since you obviously know your rights, right? I do. Okay. Uh, do you have to identify yourself to police? If I did something illegal. But you do have to identify. If I did something illegal. Okay. Yeah. Am, I, am I being detained? You know, are you free to leave right now? Am I? Huh? Am I being detained? Are you free to leave right now? He just asked you that, idiot. And now he says, no, he's not free to leave. How is that possible? What's he being detained for? What's the crime? I'm not free to leave. Did I do something illegal? Nah, nah, you're not free to leave. Nah. Let me get that screenshot, man.
This guy's a punk. If I did something illegal. But you do have to identify. If I did something illegal. Okay. Yeah. Am, I, am I being detained? You're not calling you illegal, man. Am I? <laughs> I'm not free to leave. I just want to... Oh, that stupid face. Illegal? What? Yeah. What did I... We're going to determine that, okay? What did I... We're going to determine that, okay? So he hasn't determined any crime yet, so he just admitted that he doesn't have a legitimate reason to, to, to detain this guy. Chance that you might have a warrant out for your arrest and stuff like that, right? You might be a wife beater, you might kick your dog, you might rape children. Okay. I'm not going to identify myself. You're not. No. I'm not going to identify myself. You're not. You're not. You're not. Why oh, you sound so surprised, moron? Read the law. You're a cop, for the love of God. Here's your legacy, Brown, from Peru, Illinois. What's that? Feels like the right not to. I, unless I did something illegal, do you suspect me of doing something illegal Possibly. or about to do something illegal? Possibly. Possibly. Possibly, which means no, he doesn't currently suspect him. Possibly. Possibly. So no. Yes. Yes or no? Possibly. Is videotaping a um, government facility a good idea? Is videotaping a government facility a good idea? Are you the good idea police or are you the the swore to uphold the Constitution and the Bill of Rights police? Which one are you, pig? I mean, I have the right to. But is it a good idea? Is what saying? So you if it's legal. It's a great idea because it exposes pieces of garbage like you. It's a great idea. But is it though? It is. It is. Photography, videography on a public sidewalk? You tell me. Okay. Alright. Okay. 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 Free to go? Not yet. So, um... Am I free to go? Not yet. This is basically... He is being seized. His person is being seized by verbal command. If he were to try to go, this cop would claim that he could use physical violence to restrain him and cage him. So this is a seizure under the Fourth Amendment. I'm being detained against my, like, against my will. Against your will? What do you mean? I don't. I can say against your will. What do you mean? Because you told him he can't leave, idiot. What do you mean? So I walked up to you, did I not? Right. Right. And, and, you said, and, conversation, right? and now you said I'm not free to go. But I just said I'm. You said I'm not free to go, I right? An investigation. But I don't have to comply, and you, you're you you're holding me here against my will. Is it against your will? Because I, can I... Is it against your will? This cop needs the biggest punch in a stupid vagina mouth. That's what he needs. Because you're being a stupid, insulting pig. You're insulting our intelligence, pig brown. You're a disgusting pig. Am I free to go? Okay, so while I'm conducting the investigation... Well, he won't answer that question. Am I free to go? He just deflects, and then goes on with his stupid pig agenda, his blue ISIS agenda. So just cool down just a minute, okay? So I'm being held here. You cool down, pig. You cool down. You're the one violating someone's rights. Against my will. Are you against your will? I don't want to be here. And you're you don't want to be here, but you were here, though. You're, stop you're holding him against his will. Stop cop-splaining, pig. We're not falling for that crap anymore. You don't get to control the narrative anymore. We're not as stupid as you are. Get over it. You're, it's done. Your cop explaining is done. We're not as dumb as you are. We're not as stupid as you and your family. You are here, right? But I'm no, here. No, you actually walked back up to me. I'm here taking photography because you told me to stop. You're like, no, hey, yeah, I said, hey, can I help you with something? Okay, well, am I free to go? I asked, are you? Am I free to go? You understand why? Yeah. Again, he won't answer if he's free to go. I don't care what someone else did. I'm engaged in perfectly lawful activity that you swore to protect. You are either is, is taking it a legal? photograph. What's suspicious about it? I'm out here. You want me to finish or are you going to keep interrupting? No, we don't want you to finish. We want you to go to hell and get the hell away from us. That's what, And leave us alone. That's what we want. I, I'm just trying, I'm trying to, to explain it to you. Right. If, you. if you don't want to know, you are free to go. Okay. I am free to go? I just wanted to explain why we were having contact with him. No doubt. If that. you don't want to listen or if you want to keep interrupting, then you're free to walk. All right. Was I was I free to walk a minute ago when he told me I wasn't? You did contact with your friend. So. 
Was I free to go? Now the cop's saying he made contact with him first. As if he went up to the gunman with the costume and said that he's not free to go. This cop is a psychopath, people. This first cop is a psychopathic, crazy person. Holy crap. He's going to hurt somebody if he hasn't already. And I promise you that this psychopath cop has no problem ruining people's lives. You're gonna read it. You're gonna see him in headlines one day. I promise you that. You're free to go. You want to go? It's a consensual go. encounter. Okay, but before you. It was a consensual encounter. Now he's lying on film or on on camera. Now he's lying on camera. This is disgusting. Just told me about a minute ago. I was just saying that I wasn't was gonna, free to go. I was gonna talk to you, right? I but you told me I was not free to go. Sure, you want to stay here and talk to us? You, you, you told me I wasn't free to go. Right. You're good to go. You're good to go. Okay, so I'm, I'm just asking. Right there. Right. Can I get you're your name and badge number? Brown and then badge number? 20. Okay. I, it's just, when you told me that I wasn't free to go. I know. The investigation. But I'll before, that, before was I free to go? You're free to go. Before was I? You're free to go. Before was I? Before was I? See, again. This is another tactic stupid pigs use, especially psychopaths like Corporal Ken Pink from Pasco County Sheriff's Department, Officer uh, Deputy Booty Aiken from Pasco County Sheriff's Department, um, Chris Davila from Pasco County Sheriff's Department, Ojeda from Pasco County Sheriff's Department, Ojeda. They, those, they all share the same personality as this brown guy. If there isn't a camera around, they will hang you. Again, they don't care if there's a camera. You see him lying and flip-flopping and lying over and over again. Now the guy says, was I free to go before when you said I wasn't? And he won't answer the question because the cop is a disgusting pig tyrant liar. Scumbag. I'm not asking about right now. I know, but I'm asking about before. I know, but now that I illegally got answer the question, pig. Stopped. Is it legally? It was consensual encounter it, it was. I'm not asking about right now. I know, but I'm asking about before. I know, but now that I illegally got stopped. Is it legally? It was consensual encounter it, it wasn't consensual. It wasn't consensual. It was, consensual. Encounter. Consensual. It was a Terry stop because you told me I was not free to go. You told me I was. You told me I was. It was a Terry stop, liar. I'm free to go. I make contact with you. I want to make sure that I, I never did anything illegal. Okay. And you held me here against my will. You're free to go, though. But you held me here but against you're my still will. here. Okay, I know. Hey, well, all right. You held him against his will, idiot. Stop cop-splaining. You're a disgusting pig. Now I'm going to have to call this department. Brown. Now I'm, you know, since I already was making a video and now you want to do this, I mean... I, I am going to be making a complaint. Okay. Because you told me I was not free to go. Okay, but you are free to go. Now, now I am. After, after the sergeant said. No, but you are free to go. I know. Only, you're only saying that because the sergeant no, said. You're free to go. I want to make sure that you can need police assistance if you need anything. I told you no. But, and, you but, but you still told me you were conducting an investigation. I am conducting an investigation. Then I was not free to but go. Not, now you are. Okay, but I wasn't before, okay, correct? Right, but I wasn't before, correct? You're good to go. I, was I want the pig answer the question, pig. Oh, my God. This dude is making me so mad. This is a disgusting pig right here. He's asked you at least 15 times now. Was he not free to go before when on camera you said he was not free to go? This is a tyrant of the highest order right here. Not before, sir. Which one? Oh, they are? Okay, no problem. All right, best one with you. All right, Thank you. Day, sir. You too. There you go, IDC Chris, guys. IDC Chris. There you go, guys. Sorry about that pause there. I was just thinking about the text I just got. Subscribe to IDC Chris. He gets about 300 more subscribers. He can go live. And since he's on the road, let, let's see if I can call. I'm going to pause this see if I can call Peru, Illinois police. All right. Peru, let's call. Thank you for calling.
calling the Peru Police Department. To file a police report or to speak with an on-duty dispatcher or to speak with an on-duty police officer, press zero. To speak... Welcome, dispatcher. This is Tina. How can I help you? Yes, ma'am. May I speak to a police supervisor? Speak with who? A police supervisor. Um, in Peru? Yes. And what's it in reference to? Uh, another officer. I'm sorry? Another officer. Um, let me see. One second, okay? Yes. La la la. Pause it for a second. Hi, may I help you? Hi, sir. This is the chief of police of Peru? Yes, it is. How are you? I'm well. How are you? I'm not so well, sir. I just uh, watched one of your officers on uh, the internet there. His name is Brown. I was, wondering, hey. I was wondering if he still works for you guys. Yes, he does. He does? Uh... He uh, unlawfully seized a person on the sidewalk for constitutionally protected activity. Is that a common thing the Peru Police Department engages in? No. Was he ever disciplined for that? I can't comment on disciplinary matters. Do you guys enforce victimless crimes in general? Do we what? Enforce victimless crimes. Oh, can I ask you something, sir? Are you recording me? Uh, yes, I am. Okay, you do not have my consent in Illinois. It's a two-party consent. Okay. So if you're, cons- you're welcome if to you're- hang up, sir, if you want to be a coward. Okay, yeah, I won't. if you want to talk to me, I'd be more than happy to have you come in and talk just, with just me. Just not on a transparent record, right, coward? Yeah, yeah. Okay, if you, you want to talk to me in person, bye, bye. There you go. Coward chief of police of Peru. There you go, guys. Peru, Peru Police Department. Uh, all right, everyone. Have a good day. I'm going to go live now and talk about the YouTube union.